Y'all, I have to admit, my bank account is probably looking at me and going, girl, what are you doing? I've been doing quite a bit of shopping since I have started my sewing journey. I have just been going crazy when it comes to buying patterns and fabric and I recently took a trip to LA for work and I'm like you know what work-life balance my mom's in town to support me while I'm at this film festival so I figured we would just take a little bit of that time and head over to Mood Fabric Store. This is a fabric store that I have been itching to get into since I have started my journey so since I had a little bit of time we dashed over there so that way we can take a peek at what they had. So before I show you all the blog footage, I just wanted to give you all a little bit of a disclaimer because you're probably going to get a little whiplash because I was just so excited as I was going down the aisles looking at all the different fabric that they had. So I was kind of showing you all the fabric and what the store looked like at the same time that I was just kind of in all and viewing everything on my own typically when i vlog i'll go and scope everything out on my own first and then i'll go back and i'll film the content but because i was there on a work trip and i had a very limited amount of time that i can spend there things were just kind of moving and going along so just wanted to give you all that disclaimer before i show you all the vlog footage and i'm actually happy that i had only a little bit of time to spend in there because you can honestly spend all day in that store that's how big it was that's how just like interesting the fabric was to me at least and yeah i just i just had a good time with the amount of time that i spent in there it was just the right amount you'll also see in this footage you might see a little bit of snippet and a clip of my mom i'm like the person in my family that's like always sticking a camera in everybody else's face so before we went into the store i was kind of trying to do a quick little intro and my mom was just looking at me like girl can you hurry this up um i'm definitely that like family home video person can we bring those back by the way okay um i'm definitely that person and my mom was like running from the camera as i was vlogging and just like sharing my experience and things of that nature so i thought that that was super funny but before i show you all the footage i also want to show you some of the fabric that i picked up while i was there again y'all I'm balling on a budget so I did not get a ton of fabric but I did pick up this please say I guess you can call this like periwinkle blue very light baby powder bluish purplish is this purple it's not purple it's definitely blue um they have a little sticker on here I don't know if you all can see it that's the number or the details if you are interested in picking this up for yourself but if you know you know and if you have been watching any of my earlier sewing videos that I've posted within this year I've been ranting and raving about how I want to make some type of matching pant and blouse set and this is definitely what I'm going to do with this fabric I am just oh I am just so in love with this fabric. I'm so happy I came across it and I cannot wait. Can I wait to cut into it? Um, I'm gonna stop rambling and just dive into what my experience was like when I went to go check out the mood fabric inside of LA. You all, it was a little bucket list moment of mine to just go there to check it out. They had so many things to choose from. I'll kind of narrate you all through the things that I'm going to be showing you all because again, I was in real time just in awe showing you all all the things as I was walking through the aisles and I wasn't really giving you good angles and glimpses and moments. So I'll be narrating a bit of this video, but I want to quickly show you all that fabric. So let's jump into the vlog. Hello, hello. What's up y'all? Guess where I'm at? I don't know if y'all can tell. I'm in the parking lot. And my mom is here with me looking at me crazy. 
and getting out the car and running because she doesn't want to be on camera. You're not going to say hi? Mm -mm. Why? Oh, what? No, thank you. Anyways, we are here at Mood Fabrics. I am super excited. So, I'm here. My mom came out to... Uh-oh, my camera about to fall. My mom came out to support me in the film festival, but also I thought, while I'm here, let me also go check out Mood Fabrics. Um, I don't know. I'll probably do a separate vlog. I haven't decided yet about, like, the film festival that the documentary I'm working on is in. The film festival is the Justice on Trial Film Festival, and I don't want to take away from the reason why I'm here, so I'll probably do a separate little mini vlog to just show you all what I'm here doing. You got to go inside. You not gonna wait on me? We do the video. I'm I'm almost done. The fabric store is in a residential area. They have a little parking lot, and we're about to run inside. She's annoyed with me being on camera, so I'm about to hurry up and show y'all a quick a quick little peek of what's inside of here. So let's go check it out. Oh my goodness, they are so many buttons. I'm literally in heaven right now.
fabric in this section I thought was the most interesting out of all of the fabric that I've seen mainly because I can see myself wearing or making so many different items from this material and I got so excited with just looking at everything I forgot to ask so if you know the name of this type of material please drop a comment in the comment section below I'm not sure if you refer to this as lace netting or mesh but I can absolutely see a dress or a swimsuit cover-up being made out of this so definitely let me know in the comment section below what is the specific name for this type of material This was another section within the store that I thought was pretty dope to check out because it had tons of elastic and trim to choose from and I think that if you're someone who's getting into undergarment sewing and you want to experiment with different color waistbands and elastics it was super cool to just see that they had a variety of different options to choose from.
they also had a huge selection of rib knits which is great for those sweatshirt collars and sleeve cuffs or maybe even bomber jackets and ugh, this was just eye candy for me and got me thinking of tons of projects that this would be great for. something what you mean? Yeah, un something that was unusual to talk in my kids about what's unusual about it this is the different patterns and texture that it has in it so how would you basically sew this without a problem is this really balenciaga fabric S stella mccartney mm -hmm. So that was a little bit of my experience when I went to go check out Move Fabrics in LA. I really wish I had more time to spend inside of that store, but my wallet is probably like, girl, thank goodness you did not have more time to spend in there. However, since I am so close to LA, I live in the Bay, maybe, I don't know, later on down the line, I'll take a personal trip out there to just really spend my time not only checking out move fabrics but maybe some other fabric stores out in la so if you are in the la area or you are familiar with shopping for fabric and things of that nature out there leave me some recommendations in the comment section below so i can check it out and just kind of plan my next trip out there because the next time i go i really want to just spend my time just really getting a chance to check out the different fabrics and the other places that have fabrics and sewing supplies and things for me to check out i really enjoyed the time that i spent there if you like this video and you're interested in seeing more of my videos and what i'm up to and things of that nature be sure to subscribe to my channel it really helps me out as an independent content creator thanks for watching and i'll catch you all in my next video bye